guys, today I have a fun video for you. I have a little Christmas Shein haul. So I have some different accessories. I have a few pairs of clothes to wear. I'm thinking I'm going to make this a try on haul, but no promises. And also, I got the Shein app, so it actually shows me how much everything was in the app. So I can tell you the exact prices I paid for everything. Most of the stuff was on sale, but even if it wasn't, I had a 15% off coupon that goes on top of your whole purchase. It's Sarah Ray, R-A-E, like Sarah Ray Vargas. She has a coupon code. I use her coupon code every time that I shop on Shein, and I've made about four purchases in the past week, which, like, I need to stop, but I use her coupon code to get 15% off of everything. Now, today, I'm showing you a uh, Shein order that cost me $46.46, so I make a lot of Shein orders, but they aren't a lot of money each, so I think I'm going to combine a couple of them and turn it into one bigger video. We'll see. They haven't showed up yet. This showed up today, so I wanted to do a video today. This is so cute. So this is the first thing that I got. I see a little bit of hot glue sticking out of it, but it's very cute. And it's a pair of little cat ears, but the cat ears are little presents. But if you see closely, there's some hot glue in that red one. Which isn't a big deal. You wouldn't even notice when you're wearing it. And I can probably pull it off. But just something to note. That it's not perfect. And they feel like real like presents. Yeah the hot glue just comes off. So it's fine. Can't even tell anymore. But yeah they're like. They feel exactly like a bow. Let's see what they look like on. How cute are these? So cute! I love them. I'm gonna keep them on. And those were $1.79 with my coupon. Not bad. Cute. This is a set of scrunchies. This feels a little scratchy, but it's a plaid one. Like red and green and white plaid. This one's also red and green plaid, but it's a little darker and it doesn't have much white on it except for the snowflakes on it. Which the last one had snowflakes too, but you can tell that they're different. Here is a red and black plaid with snowflakes. And it's got a little bit of like silver thread throughout it, if you can tell. There's a little bit of silver thread in there. And then the final one is so cute. It's like Santa's suit. So it's red and it has a white fur trim around it. That's so cute. And for a set of four scrunchies, it was $3.11. The next thing is a face mask. This is so cute. It's little candy canes. It's like red candy canes on a red uh, mesh background. And then the actual face mask is white underneath. It's huge. It's really big. But it's so cute. So that's cool. And then they have these adjustable little straps because it's actually pretty big on my ears. So let's see. Yeah, that fits better. But it's still humongous on the face. Cute! I like that. And the face mask was $179. This is a little dress. Very excited about it. I expected it to be a little thicker. It's kind of thick. It's a thicker material, but I expected it to be softer and even thicker than it is. Oh, this is precious. So it's a red and black plaid. It's got about three quarter sleeves. It goes in in the waist and then it goes out at the bottom, like an A-line style dress or a skater dress. So, so cute. And this feels like a nice, a nicer, more thick material than their summer dresses. So you're going to get nice and warm in this and you won't be freezing your butt off. So adorable. I really like that dress. And that was $12.42 for a nice little dress. How cute. 
here's the little dress on it goes past the knees so it's a nice length and the sleeves go about three quarters of the length down um it's a pretty dress i think it's cute it's flattering i think it looks really good on the only problem is if you can tell when you stretch it like if i go like that and then i stretch it you can see it gets like white uh, where it's been stretched, which includes my boobs. It stretches it a little bit. And the arms, they're stretched. They're a little tight on the arms. And if you had any bigger arms than me, they would be really stretched. They'd be really tight. Um, it fits me and I feel comfortable in it, which is good. But if I was any bigger, this would not fit me around the arms and around like the, the boobs. If I had bigger boobs, this wouldn't fit me. So something to consider if you have big boobs or big arms, this might not be the dress for you. But it's really cute, I really like it. The next thing I think is a top. It is. Ooh, nice, very nice. So this is a little, it's not a crop top, it's pretty long, it goes down all the way. But if you can tell in the front, it has this little crisscross detail. I think that's so nice. It is a little bit see-through. It's a little thin. It's ribbed, if you can tell. So it is a little bit on the thin side. I don't think it's really going to keep you warm. It's got full length sleeves, it looks like. If they look a little short, though, they might be a little short. Yeah, they're going to be a little short. I have monkey arms, as I like to call them. So I have really, really long arms, so I really don't think this is going to go all the way down to my wrist, but it's still adorable. And I got this specifically for a skirt that I'm going to show you later. It's also the reason why I got this other shirt. So I'm going to show you the other shirt, and then I'm going to show you the skirt that I got to go with the tops. So that was the first top, and that was $13.23 which was more expensive than the dress, which is strange. So here is this little top on. It's really cute. It feels like really nice quality. It goes down, here's my hips. So it goes down pretty far. It goes down to the crotch, basically. The cross is a little high. Personally, I don't like things around my neck. So it kind of, uh, a little bit. If you know what I mean, if you don't like things around your neck, it's kind of like, Mm, kind of annoying. You can see my bra strap because it goes pretty wide. It's a big old scoop. It's pretty low too. It's almost like right at the top of my bra. So something to consider. If you're not a big fan of showing off your cleavage, it's pretty low. And this is pretty high. I think it would have been better if it was more like this. And it was a little higher and maybe a little bit just smaller in general the big gaping hole of the shirt <laughs> if it was a little smaller i think it would have been better it does fit me well the sleeves are too short i knew they would be um sleeves are usually too short for me because i have long arms but i mean it's just something to consider if you have short little arms they'd fit you but if you have longer arms it's going to be a little short which is a shame because your wrists get pretty cold during the winter so something to think about um it is a really cute shirt though it feels like really nice quality and i'm really happy with it i'm gonna keep it there were just a few little things about it that i didn't quite like but if i wore a different bra with it i think it would be fine i have a bra where the straps are always falling down this would be the perfect shirt to wear with that <laughs> and i'm really happy with this little top this top was 7.99 which is more like it I don't know why I spent $13 on the top. That seems expensive. Especially for me. I'm cheap. This feels cheap. This feels really cheap. Um, I don't know which way is the front. I guess the front is this way. So this is very see-through. And it feels very cheap. The other stuff might be see-through, but it doesn't feel cheap. But this does. It has a little lettuce end. Lettuce ridge end. I don't know what they call it, where it kind of ruffles. And it's supposed to do that around the neck too, but it just looks stretched out and kind of ugly. There's no tag on the inside to show where's the front and where's the back. 
I'm not really a fan of this. It's a t crop top, which I'm wearing a crop top now. <laughs> I probably shouldn't be because my belly's hanging out. I'm just going to pull those pants right up. But yeah, I'm not a big fan of this shirt. I might be returning this. And this shirt was $7.99. All right, so here I am in this little outfit and I love it. <laughs> Even though this shirt does feel a little cheap, I love the way it looks with the skirt. It's a little see-through if you can tell. It's a little cropped. Um, it goes all the way down to the wrists, which I love. The neckline looks a little stretched out, if you can see that. It just looks a little weird. I don't know. A little unfinished, maybe. Not a big fan of the neckline, but I think it's really, really cute. It fits me well. It's just a really nice top. Even though it's see-through, even though it feels cheap, I really like it, especially for like seven bucks. I'm going to keep it. I forgot I was wearing the cat ears, and I'm like, what is this? that all right here is the final thing Ooh, this feels nice this feels really really nice feels like great quality and it's nice and soft really really soft let's see what the inside feels like scratchy <laughs> yeah that's how i thought the whole thing would feel but it's actually really soft on the outside i don't know if you can tell it's like a brushed kind of thing but here is the skirt. So it has a little flap in the front, which is really cute. And it's black and gray and white plaid. And it's got a zipper on the back to get it on. Really cute. It might be a little small though. It feels a little small, but that's a shame. I hope it fits. I mean, it does go up on the waist a little bit, so it might fit me. Fingers crossed this fits. This is adorable. And it feels so nice. And that was $6.13. $6 for this awesome skirt that feels like great quality. You can't beat that. That's insane. Here's that skirt on. I love it. It's got the little flap. It's really cute. It's a little tight. I don't know if you can really tell though but it's got no stretch, no stretch to it at all. Here's it from the back. Such a cute skirt. I really, really like it. It feels so nice, such nice quality, and it's adorable. I would say it's a little small though. It's a little snug. So maybe size up if you're in between sizes, but if you are a true 1X, like I am a true 14, I'd say give it a shot. I mean, what's what do you have to lose? <laughs> Get it in both sizes maybe, and then whatever size doesn't fit, return or give it to someone because it is the cutest little skirt and I feel so pretty in it and that's what matters. You wanna feel good in your clothes and I feel really good in this little outfit. I look so cute. Shein actually changed the way they do returns. Um, it, the whole process is the same, but instead of getting a shipping label in your like order inventory thing, they actually email it to you, which is so much better. And it makes it so much easier to actually start your return, get your return, and get your money back. And I just like last week I returned the item to Shein and I already got a full refund back which is perfect so that's awesome so if anything doesn't fit it's free returns you don't have to pay return shipping you don't have to pay to return an item so if something feels a little cheap or it doesn't fit you quite right you can return it for free which is amazing you don't have to pay for anything and it was cheap to begin with but you shouldn't have to stay with an item just because it was cheap if it doesn't fit you or it doesn't work for you so I love that about Shein it's really reliable I've never had a package get lost or anything and I love them I love Shein so that is my little haul for you I hope you enjoyed it I'm going to try these items on in my little trailer and see if you like the way they look on me. See if I like the way they look on me. I'm pretty nervous because that skirt feels a little small and that shirt feels a little cheap. So we will see it together. We will find out if these items are good. 
So thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you wanna, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.